I was like, oh my God, I am so nervous. I have never done a sex scene. I said, have you ever done one? And Mikhail goes, um, like 30, 35 times. And I was like, I'm sorry, what? Like, I'm like, what have you been shooting? I was appalled. I was so shocked. <laughs> Tell me exactly what the, the flight attendant is all about. So uh, the flight attendant is based on a book that I optioned three years ago. And okay. it's about a girl named Cassie, who is uh, the most fun girl in the world. Uh, she is an international flight attendant. She travels all over the world. She meets new people. Um, she drinks a lot, which starts out to be very cute and fun and funny that she's stealing small bottles off the plane until uh, <laughs> we find out later that she has a serious drinking problem alongside a lot of childhood trauma that needs to come up um, for her. But on one of these amazing layovers in a beautiful place in, in Bangkok, Thailand, she goes home with a passenger on the plane and has the night of her life. They go party, they drink, they get completely blackout drunk, um, spend the whole night doing crazy stuff. And she wakes up the next morning, hung over AF and looks over and um, he is dead and brutally murdered next to her. And not only is she completely hung over, she has no idea how this happened. And from that moment on, she makes every terrible decision she could possibly make to get herself back to New York and really deny anything ever happened. Again, it's funny, I watch a lot of Dateline and I wouldn't have believed the stupid decision she makes to run unless I'd seen so many episodes of innocent people in the shock, right? And you run mm -hmm. and they, you're like, and you're yelling at the TV like, just tell them you didn't do it. We we know you didn't do it, right? It I've done that so, so many times. You're like, we he didn't do it. It's so obvious. But the fear and the shock overtakes your body. And so that's what happened to Cassie. And so now she has to deal with the repercussions and trying to clear her name at the same time going down a very dark hole of emotion. Wow. So, I mean, this sounds like a regular weekend pre-COVID. No, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I want to talk to you quickly about uh, Mikhail Hausman working with him, what that was like. He's the body that you wake up to. Uh, <laughs> well, first of all, he's the body that you had a great time with, but then oh, yeah. he's the body that you, that you, that you uh, wake up to. So what was it like working with, with him? Oh, Mikhail was amazing. You know, he is such a grounded person and grounded actor and family man. And he was lovely. We were laughing because I had never done a sex scene. And I said to him, I was like, oh my God. I said, Mikhail, I, it was when we went in to shoot him, like, I am so nervous. I have never done a sex scene. I said, have you ever done one? And he's like, I was on Game of Thrones. And I said, that's true. Okay, so that's like 10 right, right there, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. Um, so I said, what do I do? He's like, stop being so weird. Just like, he thought I was being so weird about it. Cause oh, I was so, funny. so But I get it though. I get where you're coming from. Cause it's like, if you've never done one and then he's like, he's done 35. It's like, wait yeah. a minute, this isn't as special for you. Like, <laughs> you're, you're not even you're, like, I want this to, even though it's TV, I want this to be special for my first I time. was more afraid. <laughs> well, also I was more afraid, you know, with the, with the times and everything you, I want, I didn't want to touch. I was so nervous to like, and I'm sure as a man, he, maybe because he's done it so many times, but you know, there's rules in how you shoot things and what you can touch and what you can see. And at one point before we called action, I was supposed to climb on top of him and I got on top and I was on my toes with my hands in the air like this. And I'm like, oh my God, they're gonna call action. He's like, what are you doing? I'm like, well, I'm not gonna like touch you until they tell me I can touch you. So they call action and then I, kind of come down and I, my hands come down and he was like, okay, this is not looking right. He was laughing so hard at me. I was so ridiculous about it. Like it, it was, did not come easy for me. Oh, Let's no. put it that way. You have me crying. Okay. <laughs>